we should be conforming to physical devices anymore. I mean, this really brings a promise of a truly dynamic user interface, one that you can actually conform to the user. I mean, if we conform to physical devices, you start getting bad things like RSI. Um, there's no reason in this day and age that we should, we should be doing that. Devices should start conforming to us. Now, of course, this keyboard is really just a copy of what we kind of traditionally used to. It's probably not the right thing to actually do. It's a really dangerous thing to start working and start emulating things uh, right away, because uh, there are really much more uh, much more possibilities than that. Uh, you can imagine kind of a keyboard that kind of kind of drifts along on your fingers or resells dynamically. It doesn't it, even though it's resized correctly, so we're still kind of conforming to it. So there are a lot of possibilities that we're really excited about with this. Uh, of course, there are a lot of entertainment applications you can, uh, you can imagine with this kind of thing. It gets multi-user, you can have 